All right, so today we are using this Arches paper, which is 300 grams, and uh, I'm using sap green color and a purple color, imperial purple, and I'm using my yellow, is the Hansa yellow medium here. And then for this uh, painting, you can use any size, any uh, round brush, and then a micron pen, zero one size. All right, hi everyone. So let's start by splashing some clean water on the paper. We'll be splashing water here and there, and then putting water in some places, spreading the water in some places. You don't have to saturate it, it's just water in different places and then there will be some areas where there's no water. So the white of the paper will show through. You can just sprinkle the water everywhere. Next, we'll add the imperial purple. Again, the same way like we did for water. We'll just put it in different places and spread it. Some places we uh, use the brush to spread it and in other, the color can mix and spread with the water. Next, I'm adding my sap green. Same process, some sprinkle, some spreading with the brush. So now I'm adding the yellow and uh, we'll do the same process. We'll splash the color here and there and then and now I'm adding some more purple to it. We'll be adding more color because uh, it will when it dries the color always gets much lighter and here you are f free to use any color that you want to use but since I was uh, since I'm going to do lavender here so I decided to go with the purple and uh, purple yellow and green and I'm getting some more green here and there. And here I'm using the 100% cotton paper from Arches and um, here the color spreads much better on this paper. I'm throwing some more clean water so that the color spreads are more. Dropping some more color. Now I'll let it dry for some time. So now I'm sprinkling some salt in it and the salt will give it some more texture and then we'll let it dry completely. So now it's all dried up. You can see some texture 
uh, from the salt that I put. So now we'll start doodling. I'm using my microphone pen and uh, we'll start making some small petals, some shapes for uh, our lavender. Now we'll sprinkle some more purple color here and uh, I'll add the color to some of the lavender patterns here. Now we are ready to remove the tape and we are all done. I hope you enjoyed painting this simple splash and doodle painting with me. You can use it uh, for any of your homemade cards and it's just a very relaxing way of uh, doing some simple painting. Thanks for joining me and I'll hope to see you again. Thank you.